The only people he would really ever lose to were the top five. Yeah. And he was on the cusp of becoming one of them. Now it's like when you when you were there and then you stop playing and you let everyone get ahead, it's just such a difficult grind to catch up. I mean, there are people who have gotten ahead, but for the most part, KK has maintained his dominance uh, in Canada, at least. For like, sure. He's still amazing here, despite the fact that he's not active at tournaments. I'm not sure what kind of practice time he puts in behind the scenes, um, but you know, largely it's not what he used to do. Oh my god, quick combos to start the game, almost dead off the top. Rick Money. I, like, I was expecting a fair, uh, fair in there, but he got two up airs and, and a quick stock coming out. Man, KK back is so ridiculously good at this match. Did you see when he almost JV5 Kalamazoo? It did. It. Oh, and watch I that. I think, the, I think the whole match is like a Giffy Cat. Because he gets, he gets a zero to death in 10 seconds, and in the next interaction, he gets another zero to death in 10 seconds. Yeah. Oh my god. And his, his shield drops, everything that he needs to do is so on point. Like, he has an answer, answer for every option of uh, Luka right now. Yeah. Make it must look so easy. Oh it is, god. man. It really is There's so back easy air, for That'll close a quick stock. Not the greatest DI coming out from Luka. And adjust his glasses. I'm not sure what that's going to do at this point. This is, uh, <laughs> this is a rough, rough situation. This, this matchup is really difficult for Peach. I think um, you pretty much have to space yourself with back airs but retreating back airs uh -huh. like it's it's hard to approach sheik um, we're seeing that now for sure and a, and a good sheik isn't just going to get randy like aerialed on shield to down smash not not kk he's not going to put himself in a situation where he's going to be stationary for a long enough time that he's just going to get hit on uh, on shield especially when he's like the main aggressor oh my god fast there before no frills could do anything and he's dead again once again we're looking at a potential four stock right here confidently say that this is not a surprise to anybody yeah it's probably gonna be four stock. we'll see we'll see luke looking to close out a stock here here's the potential to do it and okay she's got a regular turn up i think in that case like you gotta you gotta really space the reverse nair and reset the situation again oh he hits him Sheik, oh, Sheik, it. Peach, it's, you gotta like edge guard Sheik really hard and the way that you do that is you just rinse repeat the same method over and over. So hold ledge until Sheik has to force herself on stage, hit her back off stage with either a down smash or a reverse uh, float cancel in there, and you just gotta keep doing that until she dies. Otherwise, like this happens. Oh, oh. Okay, there's a stock. KK with the nod. It's potentially a JV4. If he can not get hit here once. Can it happen? Oh, so, no frills. He's so, no frills you. already yeah, doing a lot better than Kalamazoo in this matchup. Take <laughs> that, Kalamazoo. <laughs> yeah, in your face. Yeah. Now he works for Google. Oh, there we go. That'll close out the stock. Still looking really easy. Very much in KK's favor. Uh, you know. No frills Luke's gonna have to pull something serious yeah. out of his uh He's gonna out upset of the KK, there. that would be phenomenal. Yeah, he's gonna have to pull a couple bombs. Actually, even faces. if he does, we'll see. Even stitch if he had even if he had a hack that he pulls a stitch phase every, every single time. Every time imagine? Pull. Oh my god. Who, who knows? How this matchup would go, because he's still gonna pull them at one point, like, right? Imagine the turnip pull was as prevalent as Luigi misfires. Yeah, yeah. That would be insane. Like you get so many turnips. How many? Uh, how, many uh, how many turnips has Luca pulled so far? I, uh, he pulls him during the edge guard. That's the one time you see him pull him out. Even there, he yeah. actually he opted not to pull, try to go for edge guard. I feel like that would be the opportunity for him to, you know, be patient. There's the turn pull right there. But he's not getting much out of them. No, I think he's, he's just kind of like chucking them, hoping that they'll do something. But yeah. you gotta you gotta plan them, you know. Like, that's your bread and butter. Yeah, he's got to make sure that he spaces himself out. So even if he does throw it, he's not going to get an immediate follow-up hit from uh, KK if he misses, yeah, right? He's doing a much better job. I guess, I don't know if he figured something out or if he's just decided to play more safe. But he, uh, he's racked up some percent on KK. He's a... Uh, it's KK got really excellent spacing on these fairs, just kind of barely dipping his fingers into this. Like, I was going to say, Luke is doing a better job of not like overcommitting, but then he just got grabbed once. Yeah. And now he's at 94, getting edge guarded. 96 and counting, actually. This is uh, he's looking like curtains on the second stock right here, unless we can do something about it. Down throw to fair, up air. Yeah. Up air, okay. And that'll close it off the top. I feel like that's actually a lot harder to hit than it is. What's this, uh, what's Rick Money all about? So that's KK's boyfriend's name? Oh. Not too sure. How is it? You'd have to ask me. You gotta always rep the loved ones. Yeah. KK has so many tags. We got PTBO. Oh, wow. Potato? No. 
I don't know. P T yeah, P T B O. What does that mean? No idea. Oh well. Something to do with no frills. Yeah, for sure. <laughs> Maybe that's his manager's name. Maybe he is the manager. Oh. Man, he could have he could have killed KK, but the platform got in the way, and now he's gonna eat this up air. Yeah. That's a rip, man. Sometimes yeah. fountain can be such a good thing for you, and then other times it just bites you in the butt. Oh, okay. KK, okay. stop. Let's uh. What are you trying to do? Let's relax a little bit. Yeah, we try to. Remember that you still got to take another stock from him at year 140. So the charge up smash in the end. What is this? 2001. Yeah. <laughs> the game just came out. I didn't even know you could charge an up smash in 2001. Oh my god, KK trying his hardest to not take any hits to get a clean four stock. He oh, had the combo potential, but he misses dude. the grab follow up. He had it. If he got that oh, Nair to Nair grab, grab, I would have yeah. lost my mind. I, I've it. never seen that. KK is so good at throwing an aerial out in front of your oh shield. Oh my god, raw down smash. Spacing away from a grab and then like acting out of what it, whatever it is that you're going to do. Like he just Nair'd right in front of Luka's shield. He shielded right in front, the down tilt whiffed, and KK got a grab out of that. Is that? Is that? Oh, that was a, to grab. It was a turn up catch, threw it at him, grabbed him after he threw it, and then he, and then he threw him up and up nuts, dude. You're too good. Yeah. Ooh, Young, Monib versus Damian Tyson. Ooh, the this, run back. this is a matchup that happens quite often. Is it? Uh, well, like in friendlies, okay. I'd say who who usually takes it. I'm I, not. I, I'm actually not sure. I, I feel would, like Damian Tyson has the edge. I would venture that guess because it's Sheik Luigi, and that is not a, a yeah. funzo matchup to play. Yeah. And and the, you know the tough part for Monib is if people know the Lu Luigi matchup really well, Man, it's it's hell. hard for yeah. Monib to excel in any way. He just gets edge guarded so hard by Sheik's ridiculously long back yeah. here. And what does he what does he really do? to win neutral. He's got to out-gimmick <sighs> Sheik at some point, right? I don't know. If Sheik, if Sheik doesn't approach, I feel like Luigi can't do anything. Yeah, it's, it's definitely tough. When he, you know, for sure a great player, but he definitely gets a lot of mileage off the fact that not too many people in Toronto are very skilled. In the